John Schiavone is suing his former landlord, Warren Hughes, for negligence resulting in unsafe living conditions and the loss of his property. Mr. Schiavone, Mr. Hughes is, according to your complaint, is a longtime friend of yours, and you were living in a house that he owned? Yes, ma'am. Yes, it sir. was a large house, and it was a house that needed some renovation. Yes. Do you do that as a business or as a sideline? As a si sideline. And you've been retired. doing it for a while? Yes. Okay. So you made an arrangement to go in and rent his house. And what I gather here, there was also a loose sort of arrangement that you were going to be doing some renovations on the house. Yes. Actually, Mr. Hughes called me around the beginning of December and wanted to know if I was interested in uh, renovating the house and repairing the house. And I said yes. And after I was doing renovation, and I worked actually about two and a half months renovating the house. So you worked December and January, or January and February? December and January. And he paid you? Yes. How much did he pay you for the work December and January? $20 an hour. And you were satisfied with his payment? He paid you yes, one time? Yes, you Okay, fine. So you rented the house, you paid your rent, and you moved in when? Well, I moved in, like I said, back in uh, December, January. Okay. Well, then you moved in in December and January. Did you pay rent in December and January? Not for two months or three months I was renovating the house. Just a second. But he was paying you $20 an hour for renovating the house. We made an agreement. Which that, was? That there was going to be no rent while I was renovating the house. So you didn't pay him rent December, January, February. How much rent did you pay him in March? Eleven ninety-five minus the hundred dollars. He would give me credit for keeping the art up. How much money did you pay him in April? Eleven hundred. How much money did you pay him in May? Eleven hundred. Is that correct? No, Just your a second. Honor. So How much did he pay you in it, March? In March, I think we came to an agreement of what he did and the money, whatever that I credit him for that month's rent. It was May that he paid me. A it was $400 in May. $400 in May. What about June? Nothing. Nothing in June. What about July? Nothing. And you have no proof that you paid him anything in June or July? Your Honor, because my paperwork is locked up in the house, I gave him $745. E even in, in the where eviction did you, process... Where did you get... Hey. Pardon? Where did you get the $745 from? Earning it. Good. Listen and my to Social me. Security check. Listen to me. What do you do with your Social Security check? I pay rent. Buy what food. do you do with it when you get it? Is it a direct deposit or you get it in the it's mail? It's direct deposit. It's direct deposit into your what? To my account. Checking account. Yes. So where did you get the $795 for? All you have I, to do is call your bank and say, send me a copy of my statement. Nothing is locked up in the house. It's locked up in what bank? Brinks. Good. Uh, net spend. Great. Well, they keep records, otherwise you'd be an idiot for having direct deposit for your check. Show me where you took out $795. That's not there. That's in a bank statement. Oh. Show me where you took out $1,100. Show me where you took out any money. I want to see that.